not answered her yet, are we? Okay, let's check. So I just got it. I'm really excited. I don't know what it is, right? You know what it is, this one? This is the world history chart. The whole thing. You start from there, you see the whole thing. We can see the big picture of the whole Bible. You see that start when the 4000 BC before Christ, they got, and they have Adam and Eve start from there and everybody go down, all the way down. You can see the whole thing. This is pretty cool. Like the whole Bible, I can see it. Actually, I would like to put on the screen, but this one doesn't work. So people can see. And um, when we think about this, about the Bible and uh, the whole chart, the name, everything there. And uh, it's amazing that uh, we can see what's going on in the timeline and everything. We can see what's happening, how God created the world, how God put people in places that he, and then come down, uh, Jesus come, uh, came and then all the way down, the disciples and all of us all the way down. So total of 6,000 years. See that? 6,000 years. Yeah, so see 4,000 BC before Christ and then the Christ, we have Christ about 4, 2,000, uh, 2, uh, 2,000 plus 4,000, 6,000 years ago. Then we created uh, Adam and Eve. Not that long. Okay, when you, when you uh, go to school, you hear, oh, the, the, uh, we have like a human million years ago. When it comes to, yeah, and not that old. So when it comes look at this, the human being start about 6,000 years ago. Adam did. Right? So it's different from the science we study. You know, so much different. And people who try to predict how old uh, the human uh, was created, they just pick up some number. Million years, 10 million years, 100 million years, and they don't know. See, the life of people, sometimes they're only this much, just tiny. They never lived back then. And those days, they don't have internet. <coughs> they don't know, they don't have library. They have no phone. They have nothing. So how would they know? But if they put together like this, you can see, oh, actually human beings started only 6,000 years ago. <coughs> Not that long, not that long, but long enough for our life. Our life is only what, 80 years, 100 years, that's it. 120 is the max, but God said so, right? And we say, oh, human come from apes. <coughs> you know Charles Darwin? <coughs> no, you don't know, or you might know the people. People think, oh, in school, they, people come from apes and become human all the way when you come to think of it. Can monkey become human? No. No, I don't think so. Because the dumbest person still can cook. So you can get dressed. But a monkey cannot do anything. Can they cook? No. 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 I don't know why we think that we, we compare ourselves to the monkey. <coughs> right? It's weird. It's weird. That means you put God down that He created humans because He said, I'm going to create humans just like me. If you said, oh no, human come from monkeys, then you put down God. Right? So it's not good. Not good at all because human can do a lot of things. We can build car, we can build computer, we can build house, we can all kind of things we can build. Yeah, monkey cannot do a thing. The only thing he make my funny face, that's all and eat bananas, can't even cook, 
can you get dressed? Yes. And how can he, his brain grow develop to the point that he can just do simple things just like human do? <coughs> it's impossible. So the science uh, of a uh, uh, revolution is just prediction, assume, and then they try to put a theory together. But it's not true. When you see this, this is it. God put together all of this. Right? So, we're going to learn some more on this one. It's fun to do. Because you know who, who, who were born when, and who be, uh, uh, belongs to who. Just like Adam, Eve on the green one, all the way down, and have the, the uh, dark green, Cain, his descendant, all the way down. You can see it's fun. When you learn this thing, you will know that God really exists. God created all of us. Alright? So let us pray. Father, we give thanks to you that uh, you create all of us. Create the world and create children. We love you. We come here to praise you and glorify you. Because you are our creator. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen.